Hey guys, I'm going to be making a GoPro stand today. Um, it's just going to have a really simple square base, um, a longer shaft, might make it adjustable, and then just a swivel so that I can uh, angle it and tilt it. Um, and then hopefully I can use that instead of going out and buying one. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started and we'll see what we come up with. So all the wood that I'm using right now is from my porch, just a bunch of scrap wood that I have laying around. That's kind of also why I'm deciding to, to make one. Um, so just some pine here. This is going to be the legs. Um, and I think for this one, I'll just uh, make it equal, equal length. So about 38, so it'll be around nine inches for each leg. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start measuring stuff and cutting stuff and kind of putting it together and you'll, you'll see it come together. So we got about four of them, very roughly about the same size. That's gonna be fine. Um, Cause how this will actually be kind of going is, let's see, around around the middle. So we'll have, you know, one stand here. Um, and it'll kind of go, well, I might have to get the stand. So we'll have them kind of going around like this to make a square. Secure it on there. Um, that's not the pole that I'm going to be using, but that is the idea. So, pretty simple. I'm going to get the base and uh, start putting the base together. Okay, square base, super simple. Threw a couple screws in different areas. Tried to make it as level as possible. Um, like I said, I mean, this isn't a tripod, so it's gonna have a little bit of wobble. I mean, you can obviously get rid of that, but um, for just using these simple tools, that's best I'm gonna be able to do. Um, would have used my table saw and my other stuff, but it's gonna have my car, and my car is not running right now. So, um, had to make do with just these couple tools. 
So yeah, next part that I'm going to work on then is the top here um, and, and bu building a little platform for it so that that can swivel. Um, the idea behind that is to have, you know, from a sideways angle is to have this here and allow it to, I guess, swivel this way like that and then a spot for the camera on top. So do that next. What I'm doing there is marking the middle. I'm gonna have my two stoppers like this, and then that middle pole will go in between. I'm gonna cut a hole, you know, secure these onto here, drill a hole through there, put a bolt on there with the wing nut, and then that is going to be how I can angle it down and secure it into place. see a little bit of an angle here the base is off but um oh dang it so you can kind of see here um how that's going to work it fits in there um and then once i drill a hole to loosen it you know i could probably keep it like this it's working but over time you know i don't want it to flop off and and widen up so i'm gonna drill a hole right into there kind of secure that in place and then what I might do is uh, build a build a top here for the GoPro that fits snugly in there, so that if I do want to lean it, it doesn't just slide off. So I'm gonna go see if I even have a bolt and nut that will fit through that. So apparently I didn't hit record, um, but um, I got the stand done, um, and I'm actually using it right now. So uh, go here and pop the GoPro off the stand. I'll kind of show you what we got. So all that we really missed here was um, I took some wood glue and these little pieces of wood, um, kind of put a top platform up on top and then put a little piece of wood here so that the GoPro can kind of slide right in between there, um, nice and sturdy. And then this can swivel if I wanted to angle it down or move it. And then with the other thing that I found out is the handlebar mount fits around this. So at any point I could use that anywhere along here to give it different height. So that was my quick and easy stand for a GoPro. Thanks for watching.